morning found some uh, good camping along the lake um, there is a formal campground that costs like 26 30 dollars a night but uh, if you got a jeep or a vehicle of means you can go out along the edges of the lake and there's tons of little campgrounds like you see here yeah beautiful beautiful place Wait for the sun to come out and warm us up. We're gonna go to Detroit Lake on section six of the orbiter. That's what they're calling it, the Oregon BDR. And uh, yeah, we're gonna enjoy it, I hope. Had any spills, falls, or get-offs yet? Had a big bypass yesterday, but uh, yeah. But we don't know if it was uh, open or not. Someone had pulled the gate down, but uh, we turned around and did the prudent thing. Timothy Lake, really beautiful place. Looks like there's a little hydro dam. Um, we were talking about coming here to camp last night, but uh, good thing we didn't because all the campgrounds are full. And I can see why, boy, this is really pretty. It's blue, nice cool water, nice little hydro project here. Nested here in the, in the Cascades. It's been a beautiful morning uh, so far, we're on our way to Detroit Lake on Section 6. So uh, that's going to be 90 miles. We've already probably cut off 12, 15 miles of it already. So might be an early day to that right, to that place. Uh, we're going to try some, uh, you know, like the Lolly Lake, some of the side treks that aren't too hard. Not doing any expert sections. Just not up for that right now. It's more of an exploratory trip. See what's out here. Because I've never done 
any backcountry in Oregon. So this will be uh, an interesting uh, tour indeed. Gotta love it though. Love it! <laughs> BDR doesn't have anything like that. No, they took some uh, oddball trails through there. That was interesting. I don't think that guy is going to make it. He said it was his first time off road. Yeah. Did you see the inner tube back there? No. That was an inner tube in the trail. I don't know how many hundreds of bikes have been through there this summer? Quite a few. I think the newness of the trail will die off. But it's popular because of Portland to Seattle being so close. All right, your turn to lead. Looks like we're gonna go by a lake. Summit Lake. Just a little lake, a nice campsite up here. Just went through some uh, really, it's almost single track, it was two track. I doubt uh, many Jeeps would go through there. You would really scratch that crap out of your vehicle going through there. But uh, yeah, this is pretty nice. It's not even marked as a campground, I don't think, on the map. If it is, it's not on my map, but really cool place. It's a fun ride up through here from uh, Timothy Lake, actually. Wow, the Skyline Trail is really giving my tires and suspension an ass whooping, that's for sure. This is actually pretty good compared to what I just rode through. Nice forest though, look at the big trees and everything in here. But yeah, this is uh, taxing. You have to be on your game the whole time. Lots of, lots of big embedded rocks, lots of fist sized rocks. Uh, softball sized rocks and baseball sized rocks all over in the road. I could see where you might get a flat in here or just fall over. I mean, geez, this thing is, uh, is loosey goosey for sure. All right, well, got to catch up to Bruce. I almost had him, but I decided to stop and take a sweat break. <laughs> Woo, this is good. It's a workout for sure.
somewhere between uh, Lake Olali and uh, Detroit. We left Lake Olali. It's all burnt out, but it's still pretty. You can see Mount Jefferson behind it. And now we're down to going down to Detroit, which I heard the town burnt down. So it'll be interesting. You see the burns all behind me up here. And uh, yeah, I think we're gonna hit pavement here in a, in a little bit. The uh, GPS said 27 minutes to, to Detroit. So it'll be interesting to see what that looks like. Um, the road was interesting this morning. Uh, after Olali Lake, it's been a piece of cake. It's been just regular four service roads, but this morning started out <laughs> pretty interesting and like single, like two track that was turning into single track, lots of rock. Um, but anyway, all right, let's get a move on. Campground. 